doctors are now saying you should wear it all the time, but how much, what kind specifically, and what about the FDA's new claim that spray-on sunscreen is dangerous for kids? Ariel Wessler is about to save face, yours on The Breakdown. Getting ready to hit the pool or the beach? Don't forget the sunscreen. Sure, that sounds obvious, but how much should you use? Not a whole lot of people use the amount that they're supposed to. Dr. Cynthia Price revealed some truths about sunblock. She says it takes about an ounce to cover the average adult from head to toe. That's enough to fill this shot glass. If you look at your sunscreen bottles, they're typically about four ounces, and that's only four applications. We all know it's important to put on sunscreen, but did you know you're supposed to put it on well before you go outside? That's right. Don't expect to apply it and head out the door. Uh, avobenzone, oxybenzones are chemicals in sunscreens that need to have some time to react with the skin. Now we gotta wait 30 minutes. So find some way to pass the time. go yet. If you're the impatient type, Price recommends sunblock with zinc oxide or titanium dioxide. They don't require you to wait at all. Also, look for a seal of approval from the Skin Cancer Foundation and be sure to use an SPF of at least 30. After 30, you're only getting a 1 or 2 percentage points difference. At last, I was ready to hit the pool for a much needed break from the summer heat. Confident the sun mm. was no longer a match for me just check your expiration dates. Or so I thought. November 2009? Seriously? I'm going back inside. For the list, I'm Ariel Wessler.